You may have had an old iPhone or iPad that you used to play Minecraft on, but it might be too old to run the game anymore. You may have had worlds that you spent lots of time on that you won't be able to play on that device anymore. However, the good news is that you can transfer your Minecraft world from your old iOS device to your computer and play those worlds using Minecraft for Windows 10. This is because Minecraft Pocket Edition became Minecraft Bedrock, which is a new version for consoles, mobile devices, and the Windows Store. So today, I'll show you how to use iTunes for Windows to transfer and play your Minecraft Pocket Edition worlds again. The first thing you want to do is download iTunes. On Windows 10, you can download it from the Microsoft Store. I recommend this way because it's a one-click install and it won't download any extras like Bonjour. You also want to have a copy of Minecraft for Windows 10, which you can get for free if you have Minecraft Java. Go ahead and install both of these. Open iTunes and plug your device in. Trust your computer on your device and wait for it to appear in the top bar. After it does, click on the icon to access the device menu. Click file sharing on the sidebar. Depending on what apps you have, your list may look different, but you should select Minecraft in the menu. Then save the games folder to your computer. This folder contains all the files that Minecraft uses, including your worlds. After this, open Minecraft if you haven't already. This is to create the game directory on your computer. Then, navigate to the Minecraft world directory shown in the video in the file explorer. I will put it into the description so you can just paste it into the header bar. Now, open a new file explorer window and open your games folder that you transferred from your device. Open the Minecraft folder inside the com.mojang folder and copy everything into the Minecraft world directory. Open Minecraft and all your worlds should be there. One final note is that Minecraft for Windows 10 might not work with the old style limited worlds from back in the day, and it may generate a corrupted version if you play the world. One way around this is to convert your old worlds to infinite ones in the edit menu. Simply just scroll down and click make infinite on your world. Minecraft will make a backup of the old world, and you can play the new infinite world as if it was just your old world. I hope this helped. Thanks for watching.